Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. As I promised, I was going to give you guys the Max Warrior loadout for this brand new dungeon, so I have all the gear. Thank you so much to Spirity for lending me this set because as you guys know, I am a dedicated mage. I do not ever switch to Warrior, so I only show you guys Warrior for these types of videos, so let's just jump straight into it today. I have played over an hour of this dungeon in warrior and i can tell you this i do not suit warrior at all i've tried so hard it has not worked but you know it's okay because we're here to show you the set the max warrior set for this dungeon and then i'm going to be showing you guys me in the dungeon because i want a few i want a few okay I had to carry the rest because it was just not working out for me. So without further ado, let's take off these cosmetics and show you guys this set. So this is the Warrior Alien set this time around. So we have an amazing legendary and an amazing head and armor piece. As I said, these do kind of look like the time forged or time lost warrior and mage sets that we have seen in the previous dungeons. I think it was Underworld that we got those, was it? I think it was Underworld. I'm 99% I'm sure it was Underworld, but... Here we go, I'm gonna show you guys the set because we currently have two spells that I'm using, which is actually Explosive Mine. And Explosive Mine throws a mine that explodes shortly after, which scales physical power. That is possibly one of the best ones to use, but then the other one is also the Vortex Grenade. And I'm gonna show you the DPS on both of them. I'm sorry I forgot to show you guys my DPS on the Mage set, but I'll be able to show you guys that in the next few videos because I'm gonna be doing a Mage Averse Warrior in their DPS, so. We're just going to jump into that later on today. Well, today I'm going to record it later, but you guys are going to see it in a few days. But right now we have the Alien Warrior Helmet with a physical power full potential of 428,393 and a spell power full potential, if you go fully into Warrior, of 509. This also has a health potential, full potential of when you're maxing it out to 4,757,789. This is a level 145 armor piece and has 21,567 upgrades and also sells for an amazing 38,489,000, no, 384,930,578. They really need to add commas in that. But we also have the warrior armor piece being a physical powerful potential of 427,460. Another full spell power base of 509 is not much difference between the two and obviously we have a health of 5,101,226, another level 145 and this one has 20,573 upgrades and sells for 370,020,578 gold. That just leaves us with the legendary and the legendary is the Galactic Dual Blades and this has a full max potential of 3,877,488 and a spell power of 1,108. This is a level 146 requirement and this has 77,713 upgrades and it sells a four. Oh my goodness. So one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. One billion. 237,120,578 gold. Whew, that was a mouthful. And I currently have 30 million health. This is kind of the health that you are going to need to run in nightmare mode because it's just, it's just so much easier. You don't die as much. So I have 109 in physical power and 41 in stamina for this set right now. And uh, I'm going to show you guys the DPS. So the DPS on the explosive and mine first, we are going to be doing around 1 trillion. Sometimes it's a 900 billion. It just really depends on the luck that you have with it. But I could go down to 20 million health. I just have decided not to, mainly because I die a lot, even with 30 million health. But okay, we also have the Vortex Grenade, and that's going to do a lot of damage, like 250 every single time. Obviously, you guys can calculate that yourself, and it does a lot of ticks. So yeah, we're going to jump straight into the actual footage of today. I'm not going to be doing a voiceover for this one. It's going to be some music behind it. So I hope you guys enjoy, and I'll see you guys on the outro.
I have noticed that I definitely do not suit a warrior. I literally have around an hour of, of footage of just me dying. So make sure to stay tuned in because I'm literally just going to be doing an entire compilation video of me dying on, I mean, I jumped in the water too. But you know, that's just what Kira does best, I guess. But yeah, I, I kind of think warrior is underpowered this time around. The Damage doesn't seem to be as high because with mage you can do around 1.4, sometimes even 1.5 trillion with a full max probable set. And this only does around 1 to maybe 1.1 if you are lucky and get a high enough potential. But yeah, let me know what you guys thought of today's warrior loadout video. Make sure to leave a like and also subscribe if you guys are brand new to the channel. Or to hit the notification button if you'll be notified every single time I post a video or start a stream. I have videos ready for this week and they're all going to be in a row so make sure you are getting those notifications and i hope you guys have a lovely day or night wherever you guys may be in the world and i'll see you guys in the next video or stream bye guys